So we're back home from Designer Con. We didn't vlog as much as we wanted to. We just kind of got terrible at vlogging. We got <laughs> we got though. distracted by so much cool stuff, and yeah. we decided that we wanted to show you guys everything that we got. Well, mostly everything. Yeah, most of the stuff. Um, we got some some collectible art, custom painted figures. Um, some really cool artwork. So we're gonna take you around the house and show you guys. Yeah, a lot of original art. Yeah, original where to art. start? So we got this super cute painting, and this is a one of a kind, uh, hand painted on wood, and then the artist signed it on the back. I think it says Sonda Swift. Yeah. Or Sa Sa yeah, <clears throat> Sonda Swift. So that's the artist, and we're gonna put all of the artists in the description because we don't remember all of their names. Yeah, we don't. Yeah, but. I love that piece. I do too, and I have another one that I have to show you guys. It's so cute. Oh, and then we also Stancers. have- We bought these books. It's from a different artist from um, the one who did that piece, but these two books are from the same artist, and I absolutely loved this one. It's Adorable Circle of Life. Mm -hmm. So it's like a super cute but morbid, <laughs> you know, <laughs> it's a circle of life. Yeah. And then it just shows like... Oh, poor, poor uh, elephant. <laughs> Aww. I thought it was a super cute like coffee table book to have. Yeah. Um, but just don't let the children read it. No. At least it's really cute. Yeah, it is. And then this one, um, oh, Icons Unmasked. His name is Alex Souls, right? Solis. 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 So this one is, um, oh my gosh, it's Totoro. I haven't looked through all of it. <laughs> Yeah, Goku is really, or yeah, Goku is really Pikachu. Yeah, and then it just has like, oh my gosh, Sailor Moon. Oh my God, Popeye. Popeye. Oh. <laughs> so it just has, you know, Dexter. Yes. That is so good. So yeah, just, is that Conan? Yeah, Conan is Conan. 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 So it just has different, um, you know, characters unmasked. Heroes, Which is Casper. pretty cool. Yeah. I think it's, it's pretty cool. It's so awesome. That's <laughs> funny, <laughs> but yeah, we got this book. Uh, <laughs> every time I look through it, I just can't. I can't. Stop <laughs> but yeah, no, we got these two books. Uh, the cover is freaking. It's awesome. Awesome. I love yeah. it. I love its art. So we also got a couple other pieces from an artist that Red and I really like, Joey Super. Um, these are original, and then we also got this one too. It's painted on a coaster. Um, look how awesome these are, guys. These are painted on wood. Yeah. It's all original pieces too. We I really it. like this one. I, I just love Red geometrical Red shapes. shapes. Yeah. I chose this one. Yeah. Uh, but we do have another Joy Super piece from last year that we bought on the wood cookie. Another original. Um, so yeah. Original piece from him. It's our Great job, man. Go Great job. We got more stuff over here. This MTV Cribs. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. <laughs> um, so we can start up here. Okay. We got this little guy. Um, he has a quartz. Yeah, it's a little on quartz his staff. crystal. How awesome is How that? How cute is he? It's like a, it's so cute. And I saw him, I was like, ah, I need one. Yeah. Look at his little butt. His little butt tail. Oh man. But um, we'll put the artist in the description. I can't remember his name. And then we also got this painting, another original painting. Um, I thought yeah. it was really cool. Boba Fett, it's from a guy, his name is Matt, and he he was painting this stuff on the spot. Yeah. And I really liked it, I was like, dude, I love Boba Fett, we have to take this one. Matt Hurtado, right? Yeah. Hurtado, yeah. Hey, you remember? Well, cause yeah. Oh, cause yeah. You family, bro. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, um, this is another piece, this was a custom piece that uh, we purchased from one of my favorite artists, Camilla De Arco. I think I'm saying that right. But she, this was her first time painting on collectibles. And um, I can turn it around for you. And this was one of her original pieces. So I actually saw it on Instagram and then I was like, oh my gosh, I need one of her originals. Yeah. They're so cute. And it's it has little hearts in there. So awesome. Great, great job there. Yeah, I, like I love her. her. I love her yeah. art. And we also got this piece. Um, there, I can hold it. Look how cool this looks. That one's so awesome. This is a we custom, like, is it, 
I don't even, resin? Yeah, it's resin. Resin, and uh, look at the crystals. Both Red and I, we saw these and we're like, we need one. So we, little story, we went the first day, we saw it and we're like, man, this is awesome. Mm, I don't know if we should pick it up. Cause it was a little expensive. Yeah, but then the second day we came, it was still there and we're like, all right, we have to take it. Yeah. We have to take it. All right, we're in Cupquake's <laughs> studio, art studio. And down here, we have a misfit. Is that what it's called, misfit? Yeah. Menagerie? But look, it's so cute. It's a little unicorn. On a stand, these are handmade. Um, and they're all individual and special. But look at that horn, it's so magical. Yeah, the artist did a really good job on these. Look at the little blush, super cute. <laughs> Ruby agrees. Yep, she So does. I'm gonna put her up on the wall. Still deciding where, I think I might put her over here. Yeah, you're deciding there, or the other spot, huh? Yeah, or this side. Yeah. I don't know. She looks good here, too. Yeah, one of the spots. Gotta figure that out. Um, but then, we also got... There's another one of the paintings by the same artist who did the cat. I thought this was so cute. Um, and again, this is a one-of-a-kind. Hand-painted. Check it out, guys. Cut on wood. She does a really good job on these. They're so cute. I just love the color choices and it's just so magical. It is. It looks like it's on done on Illustrator, but it's all hand painted. Yep. It's super really, really legit. Good. It's super cute. I love it. Yeah. Uh, and then I also have this little guy down here. It's a little concha bunny. Here, let me pick it up. Yeah. Look at how cute. Oh. It's like a, a little sweet bread. It's like a... What was the name of the artist? Concha? Was it like Bon Bon? I, I have, or something like that? I have her card. I forgot. Yeah. Um, we'll put the info in the description. They were they were called Bun Bons, I think. Yeah, or Bun bon bon. Buns. Yeah, Bon Buns or Bun Bons. Yeah, I bun, think that's Bun Bon. I don't know. Bun Bon Bon Bons. We'll put the link in the, or the info in the description. But I saw this and I thought it was so cute. Like I've never seen a little bunny butt that was like a sweet bread, and I love sweet bread, and I just love the way that she added the glitter. It's just so cute. I love it. Yeah. So there's my little, those are my pieces. And then we actually have, you have a piece here mm -hmm. that he bought. Follow you. Yeah, wanna come over here? Yeah. Following Red right into our office. And he has it on his desk. Check this out guys. Look at this awesome TIE fighter right here. It is so cool. So this- I don't know if you guys could tell, but this is all metal. So this is like a bike chain right here. And then these are all individual metal pieces that he put together. Uh, I believe this is a spark plug right here. That's crazy. And yeah, this is obviously a gear done here. And yeah, he it's all handmade, all and welded he, together. He had so many different pieces. He yeah. had uh, like, like hobbies. A guy in a DJ yeah. booth. And, and they were just so fun to look at. So yeah. we felt like we really needed to get one. Oh my god! I forgot it, it comes off. Oh, uh, well, it's a screw. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a screw. Uh, so here's don't the break it. Don't break it, Red. Shh. <laughs> uh, <no. laughs> oh, we also got a couple more pieces um, by Jeremiah Kettner. He's another <laughs> artist that we love and actually read. Um, when we went to Japan, Red surprised me and we met up with him. He lives in Japan with his family and we got to see his art studio. So we saw him there again. Yeah. And um, we bought a couple pieces for our kitty room. <laughs> Aren't they so cute? Reminds me of Lincoln Nobby. <sighs> yeah, I saw these and I was like, we need paintings in, in the cat's room. Yeah. He did, he... His art is always so amazing to look at. It's super colorful. It just makes me so happy every yeah. time I look at it. So, yeah, got these two pieces. And Great job, Jeremiah. Yeah, love it. Always love his stuff. But is there more? Is there more? Is that all the? Well, all the other stuff we bought are gifts. Oh yeah, we got. We got show you guys. We got some those. gifts, some Christmas gifts. Otherwise, <laughs> whoever's watching this video will know. Yeah. We got them. Well, that's all we got. I felt like we had a bunch more, but I think last year we did. We did a lot of damage. Oh last yeah, year. last year we so. bought pff, 
so many things, but we we're I think we were we were very careful and selective with our choices this year, but they're all really good choices. Yeah, I actually have some pieces up here on the wall that I bought last year. Yeah. Um we have the Linda Panda kitties, which I thought were so cute, and there's two other ones that go with this. Mm -hmm. And then also this one, um I forgot the artist's name, but I just really liked it. So we did get some pins this year. We got a lot of pins. Yeah, I and then that. I and then actually these are from Designer Con too last year. And Mab Graves is the artist. And here's another Jeremiah Kettner. Um, so yeah, you can tell. Oh, there's another piece right here that's from Designer Con. We love Designer Con. Um, yeah. But pins. One of the best. We've actually started a pin wall. Check it out, guys. So yeah, you got, got some. Kylo Ren and a Rogue Fighter right here. Those are and, awesome. And these, these pins glow are in the dark. so detailed. Yeah. Oh, and then the I actually got this little um, flower with a little face on it. Mm -hmm. And then I think we got this one too for free yeah. for purchasing. <coughs> um, and then there's um, a Joey Stuper pin. Yeah, I got this California Bear. Yep. I liked it a lot. Um, oh, and here's the bun. Yeah. The artist who did the little bunny. Uh -huh. So yeah, we're, we have a little pin wall going on here. Yeah. Um, we're not like super huge collectors, but I think we're starting to now because yeah. we have a place to put them and it's and it's in our office and we can just display it just when you yeah, know right people when you come in. Walk in. So like, Oh, that's pretty cool. So yeah. Well this lighting's terrible. Huh. Yeah, it's uh over the over the head. Let's it. go back to the natural lighting up in here. But yeah, I think that's it. Mm -hmm. That's all we got. Um we we ran into a, a couple fans. At Designer Con, I yeah. was able to meet them. A lot of fans, actually. More, yeah, more this year yeah. than last year. Yeah. Was really cool. So that was awesome. We had a good time. We did some shopping and um, got really inspired. I have a couple ideas for some pieces I want to actually create now. So yeah, it's always good to go and connect with other artists. But mm -hmm. hope you guys enjoyed this. I know it's a little different from our normal schedule, but yeah, why not? Why not? It's been a while since we've done one of these, so. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but we'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. See you guys.